Okay, let's have a look at the word today. So the simplest way to connect these T O D A and then Y. Now the Y is special, you notice it has one dash. That means that you can never go O and put the C on the side like you could with a T or with a B or with some various other letters. You can never do that with an O because if you, as soon as you add a single dash it becomes a Y. So, uh, first couple things we could do, we could move this Y over here to save some space. And we could even maybe try pointing the tail up in there to bring up the space. The T, I like to maybe put an angle on it or even write it to the side to save space. And finally the D, you can put it into the O like so. And when you have an O with just a line through it, it could be an H or it could be a D. The way you know is default guess is D because D is more common and H if you put a dash. Or you can even double uh, em emphasize that it's a D by adding the D dash. So that's an important combination, comes in very handy with many words. So let's try that with this. When I do my two, sometimes I like to draw the two coming down like that from different angles. Kind of makes it look like a little ears on a head or something. T O D A Y. That's a, quite a nice one too. I kind of like that because if you do it right, No, that one turned out quite ugly. Let's try that again. First we'll draw the circle. You can add a bit of a curve to that to kind of make it look like a hor horizon. Almost looks like a nice big horizon, sunrise coming up. This is today.